It's not every day that you get to see two amazing birds of prey like these bald eagles get locked in a tangle of talons and feathers and slowly spiral their way back down to the ground. It is a breathtakingly beautiful experience to behold. The moments leading up to that event were even more intense and you can expect to see a full length video on the entire thing coming soon on my channel. I shared this video almost immediately on my Instagram channel, just this little part because I was so amazed with it. And it immediately went viral. It went all over the place. And then the bad thing starts happening that a lot of people are just not aware of. When you're a content creator, it's an interesting experience to share your work with the world because it inevitably will get stolen. And it's just part of the process. I understand this and I know it's, it's flattery when somebody steals your stuff and, and uses it or, or copies you and, and uses your stuff. It's, it's a sincerest form of flattery, they say, but I still think whoever made that saying was never stolen from. So it hurts a little bit, just being honest, it hurts. This video was stolen on multiple accounts and I'd really like to thank everybody, and I mean everybody, because there was a lot of people who informed me about this when this stuff is stolen. A lot of people were messaging me and say, hey, so-and-so has posted your clip, it's stolen. And then I have to go through this whole process, this whole rigmarole, so to speak, of trying to get it removed because it's being used without my consent. Some people go so far as to crop it and remove any reference of me or my name from the video entirely because they know that they're stealing it and that they're gonna use it for, them, for their own good. Someone, a, a very popular channel on YouTube, which I'm not gonna say any names, did just that. They stole this video, this clip, off of my Instagram channel. They removed my name from it and then they used it in their video, not once, but twice. It was, it blew my mind, you know, and a couple of people alerted me to this. The great thing though about YouTube is YouTube had my back. I immediately went to YouTube and I filed a complaint, a copyright notice. And YouTube asks for some credentials, you know, for me to prove that this is my content. And I did that. And within 24 hours, I got an email from YouTube saying that, hey, yeah, this is in a violation. Here are your options. Here's what you can do. You can reach out to the, the person who has done this and try to resolve it with them, which I had no intention on doing. They 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 stole it intentionally and removed my name, you know, and it was, it's quite obvious that they did this. And their video, as a matter of fact, was nothing but stolen contents or clips from other channels, all put together under what they would call a fair use act. So there's a, there's a fair use doctrine that allows people to use copywritten content if it's not the sole purpose of their video. And a lot of times they get away with it. It's just, it's not really fair to the small content creators like myself, because I spend hours and hours doing this stuff. And then to have somebody else steal it and get a bazillion views and make a ton of money off of it and, and it's just stolen and they say it's fair use, that's not fair in any way, shape, or form. And thankfully, YouTube had my back. They have now removed this video. And it's pretty funny, actually, what it looks like when you go to the video. Now, let me put a screen over this so you can see what it looks like. So now this video has been removed and the person who uploaded it is in contact with me saying that you know they, they want to to now rectify it and, and make it all good. But you know, I think the lesson to learn in the, in the beginning with this is don't steal people's content, especially, and then don't come back and apologize once you get caught. That's just, just don't do that. So again, I would like to sincerely thank YouTube for having my back, especially somebody on a smaller level like me, that helps me be more confident in sharing this stuff in, in a way that I know I'm protected. And thank you to everybody who alerts me constantly to all of this content that's getting stolen. I know it's only gonna get worse as time goes by. I, I understand that, but I really appreciate everybody helping me. And again, I'd like to put a sincere thank you to the YouTube platform for completely and, and fastly or quickly. Sorry, I got a little bit of a cold. It, it's, <laughs> it's hard to think clear when I have a cold like this. Um, but quickly rectifying it and removing the video, um, that was super helpful. And again, it, it instills a level of confidence. YouTube's got my back. So thanks to everybody and thanks to YouTube.